a lecture entitled Global Developments, Implications for Nigeria and Capacity Building, Mr. Babs Omotowa chronicled some skills youths must acquire in order to prepare them for national development. Mr. Omotowa postulated that the progress in artificial intelligence has provided great opportunities and challenges, which he said can be inspiring and terrifying, depending on how they are exploited. The guest lecturer dwelt extensively on the role of capacity building in the development of any nation. My dear graduates, what Nigeria needs at all levels are dreamers of a certain kind, true visioners and mission builders, and corruptible leaders who can mobilize citizens towards mission building, leaders who can build partnership and attract our best talents. But Nigeria also needs creative, innovative, and engaged views. And I hope that Nigeria can count on you to apply what you have learned to this great university, to work with others to make a difference in the future. Declaring the convocation lecture opening earlier, the deputy chancellor and former Edo State Governor Chief Lucky Nusakai Igbinadion, who represented the chancellor, said Chief Dr. Gabriel Sawau Igbinadion, the ASMR of Benin, appreciated the guest lecturer for the sacrifice he made all the way from the United States to share his wealth of knowledge and experience with the graduates. Let me especially appreciate the guest speaker of today's lecture. Professor Babs Amadoua, Vice President here in Tanzania, for the sacrifice you have made over here all the way from the United Kingdom. Thank you. A member of the governing council of, of the institution and executive director, independent television and radio lady Celerina Ujomo, and other international consultants of the institution can met on the events. Oh, I advise them to maintain the excellent spirit that has been imbibed in them from this university, work with integrity, and make sure they represent IEO perfectly and truly become our Blue Sky graduates. I wish them good luck in everything. I work with the IEO, Igbejo University anyway, as the international consultant. So seeing the whole event crystallize in a big convocation of this nature and seeing the graduates excited and happy about the future, I think it's very exciting. For me, I'm extremely excited to see the impact Igbenidion University is creating the lives of uh, especially the youths and the young people. And um, my advice and counsel for them is the God first mentality. High point of the event was a presentation of a plaque to the guest lecturer. <laughs> Sharon Ajayi reporting.